If you're running an SMB or SME, dealing in B2B and or B2C services, striving for ROI, but worried your KPIs aren't impacting your EBITDA, especially taking into account your OPEX, COGS, let alone your PL, and you're ready for that new BPM that guarantees TQM and 100% CSAT. Okay, if you manage to follow all those acronyms, then you are absolutely the people I want to talk to. Stick around and I'll show you how, with Canva's Magic Studio, you can make your business's workflows much more efficient and automated. Hi there, my name's Natalie, a B2B content marketer here at Canva, and I'm so excited to take you through how Canva's Magic Studio can enhance efficiency, streamline processes, improve communication, and minimize slip-ups. But before we do that, let me show you the best place to find Canva's Magic Studio tools. So when you open Canva, you'll find the Magic Studio tools here. Magic Design, Magic Write, Magic Media, Magic Grab. I'll take you through all of these. You even have AI tools from the App Marketplace. Click on any of these or go here to find more. Actually, Joseph has a great video about some of the AI apps and how you might use them. You know, the best thing about Magic Studio is how it cuts out that unnecessary menial work so your team can focus on the big thinking work. So let's say inducting new staff members. Now, we all know how important employee onboarding is. It sets them up for future performance and engagement, but building an up-to-date onboarding kit, that's gonna take time. Well, it used to, watch this. Click on Magic Design for presentations. This uses AI to pull together the most common slides you might need for a presentation of this type. Let's go for this prompt. The more info you can give at this stage, the better. Hit return and let's see what it generates. Below, the search function has found existing templates that match your prompt. Okay, this is what Magic Design has come back with. If you hover over each preview, it'll cycle through the pages. If you have your brand kit set up, you can go here and select it. And ta-da, brand kit applied. Click on any of the previews and you can see the pages in more detail. Drag your favorites in or apply all pages. And look at that, you're already halfway there. Now you just need to make it your own. Move things around by clicking and dragging. Add in your logo and brand graphics. Double click on the text to change it. Adjust the charts by selecting and adding in your data. And this is looking on point. And in what, like 30 seconds? That's why we say first draft fast when we talk about Magic Studio tools. And do you remember how I mentioned BrandKit? Well, if you haven't set yours up yet, go ahead and watch this video with Clay. He'll take you through it step by step. And speaking of brand, did you know your brand admin can set up brand voice to work with Magic Right? meaning that you can use AI to generate on-brand copy in seconds. This is so important as keeping a consistent brand voice across all your business materials is the easiest way to build brand recognition and trust with your audience. Let's select a piece of text. Hit the magic button and select brand voice. Now you'll have consistent and brand aligned content. It's that easy. Magic Write is also good at expanding your text. Or just seeing if there's another way to say it. So my personal favorite hack is using Magic Write to summarize my meeting notes. So if you're an admin and you haven't set up your brand voice yet, follow these steps. From the homepage, select brand. Then the brand kit tab. If you have more than one brand kit, select the one you'd like to edit. Under brand voice, select add your brand voice option. Enter your brand voice guidelines in the space provided. At this point, you have the freedom to be imaginative and detailed in shaping your team's brand voice. Don't forget, there's a 500 character limit, so don't write a novel. The next thing I'd do is go and test it a few times. 
If it isn't as on brand as you'd expected, I'd return and change a few things. Keep adjusting until you're getting exactly the language your brand is known for. Shall we try it out? Now, you'll notice I'm not meticulously crafting my language here. I'm just transcribing my thoughts as fast as possible, knowing that Magic Write will fix it up for me. Hit generate. This is always the most exciting part. Wow, how good is that? It's crafted my brain dump into a brand appropriate address in seconds. I can copy that into the presentation, put some personal touches on it, create a new page, create a text box and paste it in. Hmm, I might actually need a picture of the CEO here. I think I have one on my desktop. Yep, yep, here it is. So upload that. Oh, it's a shame she's right in the middle. That is easy to change though with Magic Grab. Hit the button and it will create two distinct images. Now I can move the CEO to here, out of the way of the text. Hmm, this plant is getting in the way. I'll use Magic Eraser to take it out of the image. Much better. This corner looks a little empty though. Maybe we could add a clock with Magic Edit. Just brush the area like you did with Magic Eraser. This time there's an extra step where you say what you want there instead. If you're not getting the type of clock you want, just hit generate again. This one will work. Of course, you might decide on no background. These tools are so useful when used together. There's no more searching through multiple shots, no more reshoots. Now you have the ability to make the image work for you. And this is ultimately going to save you time and money. Oh, and have you seen Magic Expand? That's another one I could have used. Selecting my original image, go to Edit Photo. Choose Magic Expand. I'll extend it to the whole page. You'll get four options. Choose the one you like best or generate it again. These walls are feeling a bit bare, aren't they? Oh, what about adding in some Magic Media? You'll see the video option here. Let's just choose images for now. Hit generate when you're done. How amazing. This one, drag it in. Actually, it would look great as a large painting on the back wall. Simply use the magic grab feature to select your CEO and reposition the painting behind her. And there, a whole new image. Let's put a little drop shadow on the frame. Sorry, I got a little bit carried away there. Beyond how useful Magic Studio is, it's also kind of fun. And the best thing, our team is working away behind the scenes to update and evolve our AI products. So if you think I'm excited, you should meet them. Their passion for making improvements is infectious. Okay, I'm running out of time, but I've got two more things to show you. The first is how to add a little bit of movement to your presentation. Now, in the past, I would have had to go to each slide and manually choose animations and transitions for each slide. Talk about a time waster. But with Magic Animate, you know where this is going. Click on Animate. This will open the options in the side panel. Select Magic Animate. Using AI, Magic Animate analyzes your design and chooses motion that matches your content, font choices, images, and colors. This will recommend a style, but will also give you some alternatives. Hover over them and they'll give you a preview of what to expect. I'll go with the recommended one. It really works for a professional audience. This has now applied animations and transitions to all my pages and my elements. Look at this. The title has this animation, but the subheads have a different style, but they've been picked by professional in-house designers to go perfectly together. Isn't that great? And so quick. The second thing is here, Magic Switch. Now you've probably played around with this before. Here you can resize your designs into something else instantly. For instance, this presentation might make a great website, something people could navigate to in their own time. Or maybe you want to turn it into a video. Then you can add an audio track of you presenting or some music. You get the idea. One click and it's converted.
what you might not have played with before is this magic switch option. Here, you can transform your presentation into a summary, the perfect audience takeaway, or maybe turn it into a blog post or even an email, or even a poem. Hmm, might have to try that one later. Anyway, isn't that helpful? One more thing, translate. If your business or audience is multinational, well, I'm sure you can understand how useful this tool is. Look at that, the whole presentation translated ready to send out to your international team, or again, turn into a summary doc, blog post, I could go on. With over 100 languages available, Magic Switch eliminates the issue of language barriers. There is no more getting lost in translation. Okay, well, that's Magic Studio, your ultimate sidekick to boost your productivity, spark inspiration, and streamline your workflow. Do you have any questions? By all means, throw a comment below and we'll get right back to you. But that said, I really do recommend diving in and exploring firsthand. It's seriously so easy to use. Go experience Magic Studio for yourself. Go on. Oh, hey there. I've just asked Magic Switch to convert my presentation into a poem. <clears throat> Our team expands, future bright, elevating customer service delight, annual growth, a rising line, Year on year, a steady incline. New hires, clients, we embrace as we continue towards our upward race. Hmm, not bad. Maybe I'll turn the new staff induction into a poetry slam. Now, do you want more great ideas for your business? Check out our playlist. It's full of useful stuff. And have you tried out BrandKit yet? This video right here is the perfect intro. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>